Hello, this is George Sender, the guy from Pittsburgh, the real, authentic, official, original, one and only the guy from Pittsburgh, except no cheesy YouTube commentators, imposters, or trolls. And here's what I am reading this week. Now, I finished two Robert B. Parker books and uh, a Charlie Chan movie, Charlie Chan Goes to the Racetrack. I guess the thing with uh, about the horses but I did not guess the murderer. So, all right, we have here Robert B. Parker Parish Twice, a Sonny Randall, Randall novel. We have Perry Mason, The Case of the Burning Bequest, Thomas Chastain. There were two books written after Earl Stanley Gardner died. I've read them before, but it would be fun to read them after all these years. Uh, Robert, Robert Parker, The uh, Devil Wins, a Jesse Stone novel, again written after Parker died. We have here The Black Mass Murders by William F. Nolan. I read the other one, A Black Mass Boy featuring a mystery featuring Dash Hammett. Person was great fun. We have here the Marble Orchard, William F. Nolan. I can't even tell you. I'm not even sure what this is, but. Oh, the Black Mass Road of Southern California in 1930. So there's another Nolan book. It's on links, so that's why they cover things up. The Poison, Poison Patriarch, how the Kennedys. Um, on the Kennedy family and uh, Joseph P. Kennedy by Mark Shaw, my friend. You can read that. We have here The Los Angeles Murders by Rice. Um, articles on various murders, including one by Earl Stanley Gardner, which is why I checked it out. This thing is rather old. Let me see. 1947, so this is a really old book. Um, we have here Hunting Lost Mines by Helicopter. Old Stanley Gardner used to go to Mexico a lot and look for gold. So there's a lot of pictures in here. We have here a book that's $60 on eBay. Very small book. And it's a rather rare book on the Kennedy assassination. It's, now this isn't in that. This isn't what I thought. This is the case of Earl Stanley Gardner. I think this is a biography. Yeah, it's a biography of Earl Stanley Gardner. Very small one. And finally, we have Dallas Justice by Melvin Belli. This was written in 1964 about. Leo Harvey Oswald and Jack Ruby, and it, this is sixty dollars on eBay. I think this is a, this is a hard book to get. All right, that's it. Uh, I'm gonna watch some more Charlie Chan tonight and finish the Parker novels. I'm gonna put them in my groceries. This is George Sender, the guy from Pittsburgh. Going to be raining all week this week. Cat is here. She's gonna go home in a few minutes. Have a great day. Have a great evening, and stay wet, warm, dry, or cool as the case may be. Hopefully you stay drier than I am. Put out dry food about 11.30 for talkie and tiny. No talkie. No talkie tonight either. Pouring rain out there and the dish of dry food is now floating at the top of the dish full of water. I gave tiny one some wet food but I no, couldn't feed anybody else. It's too, too raining too hard. So that's the problem. I hate rain but I can't feed my kids. Alright, I'll catch you later. Have a great night. Bye-bye for now.